In the midst of economic doom and financial distress, there's one all-British sensation that's bucking all the trends of recession. An icon that could do wonders for your brand. Imagine the reach to be gained from being part of this phenomenon. It appears regularly at Britain's second most popular outdoor spectator activity, an activity that attracts about 7 million people every year. We are, of course, talking about air shows, second only to football in numbers of people attending every year. But much more than that, this icon is so big that the prospect of its appearance regularly increases event gates by 20% or more. What is this extraordinary attraction? Well, it's Britain's most popular aircraft. It's also the people's aircraft. It's an icon so much loved by the British people that they've given more than £7 million of their own money to get it back into the air. They've given their hard-earned cash in amounts from single pounds to tens of thousands, and they're still doing it. We're talking about the beautiful, the heart-stopping, tear-jerking, delta-winged Avro Vulcan, a globally unique icon. <laughs> You think we exaggerate? Well, she is undoubtedly beautiful. You can see the lineage that developed into Concorde in her lines. She also has the ability to affect people at an almost ethereal level with the sounds she makes. She literally makes the earth move. And heart-stopping? Well, look at the reactions of airshow audiences. More than any other current display aircraft, she is able to silence crowds of tens of thousands of people with her arrival. But tear-jerking? Well, you can regularly see grown men and women furtively, sometimes even proudly, dabbing at cheeks with hands and hankies as Falcon flies by. So what about those increased gates? Well, take the RAF Cosford Air Show for a start. In 2008, they got 54,000 people. 2009, publicity tells everyone Vulcan is coming. By midday, 58,000 people are there, an increase of 4,000, and that takes them to capacity for the showground. The organisers have to shut the gates and turn people around on the motorway, even some ticket holders, eventually having to refund tickets for about 1,200 people. But don't take our word for it. This year we had the largest crowd we've ever had. We had 58,000 inside the gates and another couple of thousand who wished to come in but couldn't unfortunately because the car parts were full. And that is in no small part to the Vulcan and the Vulcan effect as we called it. Leading up to the air show we were maintaining historical figures of selling tickets but as soon as the Vulcan was actually programmed to appear the ticket sales took off and then as, as I say we had record attendance or Waddington, one of the biggest airfield-based shows, a two-day show. Once again, big advance publicity for Vulcan. On the first day, 100,000 people come and the gates are closed at lunchtime. Then, because of circumstances outside Vulcan's control, she's prevented from flying on either day of the show. The second day, when people know she's not going to fly, the gate is down to 70,000, a 30% reduction. Well, here's another example of Vulcan's reach. The World Aerobatic Championships were held in Britain in 2009, at Silverstone, in fact. It was the first time the championships had been in this country for 23 years. Now, between the final competition round of thrilling aerobatic virtuosity and the awards ceremony, there's an air show to which Vulcan is invited. So, what is it the audience really wants to see? Tell us what you're looking forward to seeing today. Oh, the Vulcan, as usual. <laughs> oh, the Vulcan. Vulcan. The Lithuanian guy. The Vulcan. The mighty Vulcan. 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 Spitfire. The Vulcan. The Vulcan. The Vulcan. The Vulcan. The Vulcan. The Vulcan. Oh, I've come to see all the aerobatics. Yeah. Vulcan. Definitely the Vulcan. The Vulcan. The Vulcan. The World War II paints the Vulcan. The Vulcan as well. Part of the Vulcan, you mean? <laughs> Vulcan. Or take Sunderland, a seaside air show, one of the biggest in the country. Seaside shows are almost by definition free to the public, and they often boast audiences in the hundreds of thousands. 
Vulcan is on at 4pm. She's due to be followed by such crowd pullers as the Battle of Britain Memorial Flight, the always exciting Chinook helicopter and the RAF's latest hot ship, the Typhoon. But as soon as Vulcan has completed her show, the crowds start to leave in their thousands. So in public access terms, we're talking something very powerful, even to people who aren't normally interested in aircraft and air shows. There are plenty of those at seaside shows. The popular magazine Aircraft described Vulcan's appearance at the huge Royal International Air Tattoo in July as aviation at its best. Reporter David Halford went on to say, The Vulcan effect is so powerful that its continual hand-to-mouth existence defies belief. If ever there was a national treasure worthy of funding, rather than some middling Titian painting being saved for the nation, this is it. Sponsorship of Avro Vulcan XH558 delivers at all levels, making your marketing spend work. It offers brand exposure to millions of consumers every year. It facilitates globally unique corporate events for your key stakeholders, with real money-can't-buy experiences, such as flying in formation with Vulcan herself. You will also benefit from your association with our Education Outreach Programme, a program aimed at inspiring the next generation of young designers and engineers. So, what's the problem? Well, it costs more than £2 million a year to keep Vulcan flying. The business plan always envisaged a major corporate sponsor. It was considered, on good advice, that once she started her public performances, sponsors would follow. But Vulcan's timing, not to put too fine a point on it, was rubbish. She first hit the display circuit halfway through summer 2008, just as sponsorship was drying up worldwide. Vulcan still needs a major sponsor. She can't continue indefinitely on public subscription. In a world where much image building depends on CGI, here is a real fire-breathing showstopper. Something your clients and stakeholders can see and hear and touch and above all feel emotionally involved with. Call Michael Trotter today to see what Avro Vulcan XH558 can do to make you stand out from the crowd. Mm -hmm.